was it like filming with Celine Song? Um, it was great. Um, you know, the discussion comes up that she's a first-time filmmaker, but to me, on a personal level, it doesn't matter if someone is a veteran or a first-timer. If you're good, you're just good. And that's all I want. You want to be, as an actor, you want to be in safe hands. You want to be with someone who knows what they want and what their vision is. So it was kind of amazing to see her just thrive in this medium. And um, yeah, I'm glad that I could be part of the ride. All right. Okay. Oh my God. <laughs> How did you prepare for the role? Pass. Next question. <laughs> Okay, how did I prepare for the role? I mean, I, I, I think it's like, uh, it, it was no different from, I guess, how it normally is, um, just in terms of like my personal process. I mean, yes, there's always like a research element that goes into it. Um, in this case, it was on a practical level, thinking about the language piece of it. Um, I don't think I've ever done anything in any different language before. Um, and and in, th in this case, it was Korean. And even though Korean was my first language uh, after so many years living in the States, I've like become fully Americanized and I was born in Los Angeles. And knowing that I was diving back into that part of my identity was really special and meaningful and also terrifying and felt very exposing because language is so private mm -hmm. and to show that part of myself with your encouragement mm -hmm. and with John's and with Celine's it was I, it it's it means a lot to me um, and to be able to show what that experience is like to other people who this is a part of their American story to be bicultural and bilingual um, and have all of that wrapped up into this character in order to uh, service a larger idea just about love. Um, yeah, the language part of it was pretty significant. And then just having enough to be able to risk destroying all of it once we were actually shooting. Because uh, I was afraid I'd like, if I honed in too much on the Korean part of it, that it I wouldn't be like fresh, you know? Um, and we wouldn't be able to just find things in the moment. But I don't know. I think it ended up being okay. Mm. You did great. Oh, Not just okay. I mean, you were phenomenal. Mm. <laughs> okay, well, me. Okay. Okay. Uh, <laughs> well, do you have a favorite scene from the film? Um. No, oh, that's a tricky question. Yeah, but I gotta say, it was the scene when you and John are in bed together and talk about her song. Mm. That because I've seen it in theory, I, w I, I was reading it and as an actor, you imagined how I would you know, do it. But for our project, I was like so embedded in my character that I read it, I know what it's about in the narrative of the story. But then when I saw you guys do it, I was like, oh my God, that's amazing. Oh, that's so nice. Yeah, and um, especially John, you know, like talking, <laughs> <laughs> talking about him you know, behind his back, but you know, nothing but praise because he 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 it's made it become a alive. Role. Yeah, it's so yeah. tough, but he had the human aspect and the human element, you know, of all the the insecurities in there that you know they were so humorous. Mm -hmm. They were so mm -hmm. lovely. Yeah. yeah. So I love the two of you interacting with each other. 